The opioids, typically associated with anxiety, nausea and vomiting, hot and cold flushes, sweating, muscle cramps, diarrhea, and nasal discharge. Alcohol, withdrawal is associated with anxiety, excessive sweating, tremors, dehydration, a racing heart, insomnia, nausea and vomiting, diarrhea, agitation, headaches and potentially seizures. Sedative medications including the benzodiazepines, withdrawal is associated with anxiety, a feeling of numbness, dysphoria or a feeling of impending doom, intolerance for bright lights and loud noises, nausea, sweating and muscle twitching. What are the time frames from the onset of withdrawal to the cessation of withdrawal effects? For alcohol, it's approximately five to seven days. For nicotine and cigarettes, it's about two to four weeks. For the opioid medications, it's about four to 10 days. And for the benzodiazepines, such as diazepam and alprazolam, it's one to four weeks. As you undertake medication reduction as part of the pain management program, you're likely to experience a limited number of these withdrawal symptoms. It's important to report these symptoms back to the program instructors so that they can be aware of what you're going through. Sometimes it's going to seem extremely difficult to undertake a medication reduction or to continue on a reduced regimen. However, once the withdrawal symptoms pass, you'll then be in a position to make a rational decision as to whether you restart a medication, knowing that there may be limited benefit in being on that medication associated with all of those negative uh, problems, such as withdrawal and dependence. In summary, a large proportion of the medications used in the medium to long term for chronic pain are associated with the problems of tolerance, dependence and withdrawal. The Ascend Pain Management Program aims to facilitate medication reduction cessation so that patients can be free of the issues related to the utilisation of medications in pain management, such as tolerance, dependence and withdrawal. If you'd like to know more about the issues around medication tolerance, withdrawal and dependence, go to our website.